Okay guys, so welcome back and today we're just gonna learn how to use um, adjustment layers. Um, so I'm just gonna do a simple example for you and that way you could just continue and um, experiment with it really. So what I have is a normal um, <coughs> picture and this is um, the portrait um, that we did and we removed the background. So I'm just gonna drag it across into um, this picture to make a composition and just resize it a little bit so what I'm gonna do here is like um, take out the color right so let's try and make it black and white um, but only one of the objects so we could do that easily with an adjustment layer right so adjustment layers are basically um, layers that affect the whole the whole um, layer that is under it so what does that mean um, if we go here to this icon um, in your layers panel and we go to um, let's go to black and white first off you would see that the properties um, window here came up and we really want to make her black and white but not the, the office right so we could just um, adjust the sliders here to adjust the reds and the whatever reds occurs or or the yellows in the in the composition itself to add contrast or, or whatnot right so um, right here is fine um, just for demonstrative purposes right and what we could do here is you could see that the adjustment layers on top black and white one and it affects all the layers at the bottom of it but we really want it to only affect this layer so I could right click on it and we could go to create clipping mask and that would only apply the adjustment layer to the layer directly under it you see this little arrow here right so now you could see that there's a mask here also right so because there's a mask you can go to the mask and just identify the areas that you want or don't want so in this case we could go to the adjustment layer and paint it black let's say for example her eyes so we can bring color back into her eyes alone and that looks kind of weird right you know take it back out right or just her lips because there's a pop of color there right but you could see because I use a soft paintbrush it um, feathers it a lot right so what we could do is go in and choose a harder brush and clean up the edges in this case right it's a little too hard right so you can do it like this and select the areas that we want to adjust or leave right so in this case we adjusted everything in this picture except her lips right and you can see that a little black spot there is on her mask right but um, we could also um, apply an ad a different adjustment layer let's delete this let's delete this adjustment layer and we could go through all of these and kind of change it up right so for example we could go to hue and saturation and play with the hues of the images right and you can see here that um it affects the whole um composition right and we could you know change our wall to, to green it's a little too much too saturated all right let's change this wall to a green wall right and the lights to purple so how we could fix this first off an easy way to do it is control clicking the um selection here and go back to our mask right in the adjustment layers and we could just fill it with black and that way we have excluded it we have not clipped it but we have excluded her selection itself right 
so I control click on the shape here just to get the selection going and kind of removed it now the lights are a little off so we could go back take a paintbrush and paint black on the lights to get back the lights to the original color that they were Right. Same thing here. Right. Um, well, I guess we change it to the reflection too. Right. So we change the color, the wall there, very easily. Right. So we could, you know, just change up some stuff, and that is how. Um, obviously we could go into the if you want to be like that just paint the ground too and that way we can keep the walls right so the floor color change there right so we have the green instead by using adjustment layers right so you could keep on adding further adjustment layers um, so we could go to um, brightness levels cu curves you could go to curves and curves uh, um, a popular one that um, I always use right to add contrast to the image right and this way again I could go back into the um mask itself and start painting just to bring back some contrast right now that looks a little too unnatural so edit um, undo right so i could change the opacity of this up here right i take it off um ever so slightly now right so you want it to kind of match up with the back that way All right so there you have it that is how we use adjustment layers and just always remember that you could either use the clipping to use to affect the layer directly under it or in these cases the um, masking would just um, add or subtract to areas that you want or don't want right so that is how you use adjustment layers so I'll see you in the next one